Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So the BIOS, which stands for Basic Input Output System, makes sure that your hardware and your OS can actually communicate and talk to each other. And to access the BIOS, most users restart their computer and then hit a specific key. And this key will vary depending obviously on the manufacturer and model of your device. But normally the keys are hit, hit in delete or escape or keys like F1, F2, F10, F12 and so on, which will then, once you restart your device, will hit in those keys will take you into your BIOS. Now, if you want a quicker and easier way to boot directly into your BIOS from the Windows desktop, then just a quick way to show you how you can actually do this. And if you are maybe tweaking or overclocking or whatever or visiting your BIOS on a regular basis this may be a nice move because it just makes the whole process a lot easier. Now how we do this is on your desktop we right click and this will apply to both Windows 10 and Windows 11. Head down to new shortcut and in the field where it says type the location of the item you enter this and it's quite a mouthful so once again I'll leave this down below in the description for you to copy and paste uh, for easy access in reference. So you paste that in. And just on a side note, if we just head back to that command, shutdown obviously means your computer is going to shut down. R is for restart. FW uh, means boot to firmware or the BIOS. T is the delay in seconds, as in this case, uh, it'll take one second before the restart begins. Just a breakdown in case you're unaware what that all stands for. And then what you do is you click Next. And here we call it, um, we have to give it a name. So you can call it anything you want to, but I'm just going to call it Restart to BIOS. So there's no confusion. There we go. But obviously you can rename that and call that anything. So Restart to BIOS. And then you would click on finished and there's your shortcut now what you need to do is on the shortcut you need to right click you need to head down to properties and then yeah you'll click on the advanced tab and you'll have to check run as administrator if you don't do that this will not work because obviously this is for admin privileges and you click on ok click on apply click on ok and there's your shortcut and you can uh, you can pin this to your start if you want to have this available in your start menu or if you want easy access you can just leave this anywhere on your desktop and then what you need to do is you just double click this and um, this new shortcut restart to BIOS and that will take you directly into your BIOS when your computer restarts. And I have checked this. It does work. And obviously, I can't do that now because it will crash my recording. But just on a side note, just make sure you've saved your work and closed apps and programs and software and because you don't want to cause any corruption or lose any work. But this works very well. And uh, that's Restart to BIOS, just a quicker and easier way for you to head directly into your BIOS right from the convenience of your Windows desktop on Windows 10 and Windows 11. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.